Hello everyone, this is Ilarion and we're in the crash dive to the silent service. I will start a new game. I will select campaign and sim difficulty. As you can see, here is the initial set of orders. Yesterday, Japanese forces landed on New Britain and Bougainville in the Salomon Islands. This represents their furthest westward push yet in the South Pacific and seriously threatens our entire position there. It is likely that they will use the captured islands to establish a supply chain to support their continued advance. As of 700 hours tomorrow, you are to assume command of the new Ghetto class submarine, the U USS Sea Tiger. It has just arrived from Mare Island, San Francisco, and is currently located in the berth 17B here at Pearl Harbor. It's only right in Pearl, but it's Pearl Harbor. After taking on supplies and complete, completing your sea trials, you are to sail directly to the, for the Salomon Islands, where your mission is to sink as much enemy shipping as possible before other footholds can be established. The main focus of the Allied war effort may be in Europe right now, but if we let the Japs drive us completely out of the South Pacific, we may never be able to get it back. We are counting on you and your <coughs> crew and the other submarine forces to prevent that. You will be well ahead of any other Allied forces. We will send you any relevant intel via Fox encrypted radio transmissions as we receive it. But otherwise, expect to be completely on your own out there. I'm confident in your ability to work anonymous, anonymously, choosing your own routes and targets as needed. Good hunting, Commander Rear Admiral Thomas Withers, J.R. Kamsab Pack. Okay. Let's see, this is the list of the upgrades that I am being given. Normally, I would not be able to get any of that, but I managed to change the rules a little bit, so I get all of the upgrades in the beginning. So that makes it a bit easier to start. Now, I did make some changes, so I've got 2,000 pieces of ammunition on the dead gun. I've got 4,875 shells for the Bofors 40mm gun and 150 torpedoes. And I already have the first submission. Radio Fox message received from Comsub Pack. Navy Scout vessel reports a Kagi class aircraft carrier Tamba headed towards Allied convoy. Intercept and sink if possible. Well, let's not disappoint the guys. I'll do this quickly. So I can finish and wrap up this first episode. Nobody is up.
So, my initial attack might be deadly for the submarine as well as the carrier. sustained some damage but nothing critical. I could at this point try to attack the enemy, but I'm not here to sink every single ship because they are gunning for me. And since I've changed the output of the ship's engines, it is not really possible to outrun them. Not with the 17 knots of underwater speed. I do, however, have a chance of evading them with a bit more quiet type of travel. And perhaps I might be able to see if there is any thermal layer around that could shelter me from any enemy sonar. This ship can now no longer outrun the enemies underwater. Not the faster ones, though. Well, I say not the faster ones, anyway. But hopefully. simply outweigh the enemy. that I am bottoming the ship in a very dangerous area, but considering everything, I think that I can make my escape that way by them 
making me escape. There we go. All right. I think that will do it for now. It's a rather short video, so you'll probably not enjoy it all that much, but it's the start. As I am at work, I cannot afford any longer videos at this point. Even as I was creating this one, I had an interruption when one of the workers came and uh, greeted me through the window. So, hope you've enjoyed. Take care and I'll catch you next time.